what I've always said. It's we use Google Classroom not to put our stuff online, but to interact with students. And so we can use Google Meet as one of the ways we interact. Notice when I go to my class, it's now saying video chat is available in Classroom. So we're going to go up to the settings cog, scroll down, and it's going to give you the option to add Meet to your Classroom. So I'm going to generate the Meet link. And notice the tiny triangle. Always pay attention to tiny triangles. Tiny triangle. You can copy the link to the Meet. Now why would you want to copy the link to the Meet? If you're making an assignment or announcement and you want to invite students in, it's really easy to just stick the link in there. But it does put this link right at the top of the stream and right at the top of the classwork page. But it is pretty helpful to have the copy of that if you want to invite someone also. And then you can reset it with the tiny triangle. Now do you want it to be visible to students? What does that mean? Let's leave that on, save, and back in the class what you'll notice is that it has the meet link now right in the header and so that is going to be visible to students because I turned that on as visible to students. If I turn it off not visible to students I'm going to need that copy link. Go to the classwork page and you'll see that now, since I've enabled Meet, now there's the Meet icon, which is going to launch right from the classroom page.